With the exception of these barricades still being in place, it's difficult to tell that anything even happened here tonight. But earlier this evening, police were out in full force anticipating the possibility of anything happening. Hey, just spread it out, Phil. But I would be remiss if I did not say the officers here at UC Davis tonight have been incredible. UC Davis police, private security, barricades, and protesters all outside the UC Davis Conference Center Friday night. Later in the evening and inside, Riley Gaines, a former college swimmer turned speaker, taking to the mic to address the ticketed crowd. Gaines, who has gained notoriety for her stance against trans women competing in women's sports, speaking to a crowd in a ballroom. Before she spoke, Gaines telling Fox 40 that on her speaking tour, she expects protesters. There are protesters nearly at 100% of the universities, to different degrees, of course, I will say, coming to states like California that are, are you know, a bluer state, it leans more left. Uh, you can expect that the opposition will increase. In response to Gaines' visit to campus, the UC Davis LGBTQIA Resource Center posting this to social media. We stand with a transgender and non-binary community, affirm their right to exist in public life, including in sports, and condemn all speech and action that spreads mis, disinformation and leads to transphobic violence. Tonight's event was put on by Davis College Republicans, a spokesperson for the university giving Fox 40 this statement that reads in part, quote, We are committed to ensuring that all members of our community, including transgender and non-binary people, are treated with dignity and respect and are able to flourish on our campus. Allowing the use of campus facilities does not constitute an endorsement by the university of the event, the speakers, or the views expressed. A short time ago, the UC Davis Police Department says they did take two requests for assault tonight, but say that nobody wanted any medical attention that is believed to be between the protesters and some counter protesters here. They also said there was some minor vandalism on campus as well. At UC Davis, covering local news that matters, I'm Eric Rucker, Fox 40 News.